in this video we have been given that a b c d is a square and area of triangle a d p is 6 then we have to find area of semicircle so the first method bc it is diameter of semicircle so bc it will be two times radius bc is 2r and abcd it is a square that means ab it will be equal to bc it will be equal to cd and it will be equal to da and bc is 2r so ab it will be 2r ad it will be 2r and cd it will be 2r and now suppose cp is x then dp it will be 2r minus x and in any circle from any point p if we make two tangent to the circle suppose this point is a and this point is b then pa it will be equal to pb and suppose this point is q then from point p pc it will be equal to pq and pc is x so pq it will be x and from point a ab it will be equal to aq and ab is 2r so aq it will be 2r and now we know that abcd is a square that means this angle it will be 90 degree so in triangle adp it is a d p a d is 2r and a p it will be 2r plus x it is 2r plus x and dp is 2r minus x and this angle is 90 degree and area of adp is 6 and area of adp it will be 1 over 2 times base is dp times height is ad and it is 6 is equal to 1 over 2 times dp is 2r minus x times ad is 2r and 2 will get cancelled so 6 
it is 2r minus x times r and 6 it is 2r square minus x times r and also a p square it will be equal to a d square plus d p square by Pythagoras theorem and a p is 2 r plus x square it is equal to a d is 2 r square plus d p is 2 r minus x square and it will be 2r square plus x square plus 2 times 2r times x is equal to 2r square plus and this will be 2r square plus x square minus 2 times 2r times x and 2r square will get cancelled and x square will get cancelled so it is 4rx is equal to 4r square minus 4r x so 8rx it will be 4 r square and from here we can get x times r is 2 r square minus 6 so it is 8 times and rx it will be 2 r square minus 6 it is 4 r square and 4 times 2 is 8 so it is 2 times 2 r square minus 6 is r square and it is 4 r square minus 12 is equal to r square so 3 r square it will be 12 and r square it will be 4 that means r it will be root 4 that will be 2 and now area of semicircle it will be pi r square over 2 that will be pi times 2 square over 2 and it is 4 pi over 2 that will be 2 pi and the second method we have area of ADP is 6 and now suppose this point is Q and suppose the center of semicircle is O then in any circle from any point A, if we make two tangent to the circle, suppose this point is B and this point is Q, then AB it will be equal to AQ and suppose the center is O, 
then BO it will be radius and QO it will be radius so BO it will be equal to QO and AO is common so triangle ABO it will be congruent to triangle AQO so angle BAO it will be equal to angle QAO suppose theta these two angles they will be equal so here if we join AO then these two angles they will be equal suppose theta and now we know that AB and DP are parallel because ABCD it is a square that means these two angles they will be equal and this angle is 2 theta so this angle it will be also 2 theta this angle it will be 2 theta and now BO it is radius of semicircle suppose it is R BO is R and CO it will be also R so BC it will be 2R and ABCD it is a square that means AB it will be equal to BC it will be equal to CD it will be equal to DA that will be 2R AB is 2R AD is 2R and CD is 2R and now these angles they will be 90 degree so in triangle ABO it is A B O this angle is 90 degree this angle is theta BO is R and AB is 2R so tan theta it will be BO over AB that will be R over 2R so we get tan theta is 1 over 2 and now tan 2 theta it is 2 tan theta over 1 minus tan square theta so tan 2 theta it will be 2 times tan theta is 1 over 2 over 1 minus tan theta is 1 over 2 square so tan 2 theta it will be 1 over 1 minus 1 over 4 and it is 1 over 3 over 4 that will be 4 over 3 and
now we get tan 2 theta is 4 over 3 and interangle ADP it is A D P this angle is 90 degree A D is 2 R and this angle is 2 theta so tan 2 theta it will be A D over D P and tan 2 theta is 4 over 3 it is equal to A D is 2 R over D P so D P it will be 2 R times 3 over 4 and 2 times 2 is 4 so it is 3 R over 2 we get D P is 3 R over 2 and now we have area of a d p is 6 and area of a d p it will be 1 over 2 times base is d p and height is a d it is 6 and it is 1 over 2 times d p is 3 r over 2 times a d is 2 r it is 6 and 2 will get cancelled and it is 3 r over 2 times r is equal to 6 so 3 r square it will be 12 and r square it will be 4 that means r it will be 2 and now area of semicircle it will be pi r square over 2 that will be pi times 2 square over 2 and it is 4 pi over 2 that will be 2 pi